In oh. other news, Julian, yeah. I haven't been watching or playing anything, but I did try Me Undies. Me Undies. Sponsor Look at the that. podcast. Sponsor the pod. Look at that. I'm, I am an actual user who purchased your things. <laughs> Guys, Me Undies. It's a mixed result. I have to say it's one of these <laughs> these one of those underwears that you don't really feel when you're wearing it, but then when you become cognizant that you are wearing it, then it's like you really know that you're wearing it. That's been my experience so far. You know but you're that, wearing it as is that a good thing or a bad thing? Not usually. It's yeah. like you, I don't know about your relationship with your underwear, but my relationship with my underwear is best when we're like acquaintances. Like I see them a couple times a day and that's it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I've got your standard run of the mill underwear. I've got the the old loose boxers that, you know, I come across them every now in the laundry cycle and uh you know, I I like their design. Okay, let me get one. I I see it. Right Let's there. see it. All right. I like this one. I'm it's fantastic that both of us have underwear within <laughs> arm's reach. <laughs> I bought these ones. I, no, my mom bought me these ones. Oh, they're so uh, cute. It's yeah, cute. It's an it's an umbrella. It's got the elephant on there. It's a nice design. I like it a lot. Um, but, you know, it's the loose boxers. You know, They're great when you're just walking around in your boxers. But you ever got to put your pants on? It's annoying. You got to run your hand all the way down. You got to flatten That's it out. That's what I'm saying. I annoying. wear the boxer brief. Uh, as was demonstrated by my MeUndies. And I have to say that the boxer brief to me is superior to the boxer. I can't Definitely. wear the boxer. That's too much looseness. I don't I well, don't feel tucked away. I need to feel tucked, which is the thing that I think MeUndies does really well. <laughs> but no underwear is supposed to hold up to 12 hours of rigor. <laughs> well, and MeUndies struggles. It's, it does its best, but it's not. It's not. <laughs> It's not perfect, but it's very, very good. Good, good. I mean, it's it's like I'm saying, you know, I don't. It's totally in perfectly fine condition. I'm not gonna throw it out. It's just at part of the laundry cycle where you know uh, I still have these. God damn it! You, you just put it on. It's like, uh, well, I gotta wear something, and then you just you put it on and you throw it down, and you know, do the whole thing. Oh. I do agree. The boxer brief is the way to go. It keeps everything tight keeps everything professional and you don't have to worry about it when you're putting on pants so you go between the boxer and the boxer brief you would like you cycle you've got both in the standard rotation oh, it's not of course. just like I, I only the have boxer so many is there for the emergencies that's what the boxers are in my underwear drawer <laughs> i the, do the know boxers in my underwear drawer are emer breaking case of emergency that... it's like i've gone too long <laughs> there's no underwear available i'm too lazy to do the laundry <laughs> these are what's available but i only have so many pairs of underwear i'm trying to keep it keep my clothes to a minimum at this point I have it's it's overflowing. It, the reason why there's boxers there is because I don't I don't enjoy putting away clothes. It's 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 annoying as fuck. So it's like it ends up, especially with my drawer situ my dresser situation over there, which you can't see. Thank God. Uh, is you know it's packed to the brim because my mom keeps giving me clothes and like, come on, mom, I. <laughs> I'm turning 30 on Sunday, Mom. I don't need you to fucking do this. And she just keeps giving me, so it's getting cold out. You need this sweater. I'm like, Mom. My dad does I, this to me with jackets. I get a new winter jacket every year. I've got so many jackets. I've got, I've got like six more than, than oh, Laura God. has. They're, my coat hanger is literally pulling off of the wall because I've got too many winter jackets. Oh, my God. Mom, and these guys on Wall like, Street, they got six, ten jackets. <laughs> it's like, thank you, Mom. I appreciate it. Don't get me wrong. It's really nice to receive a warm sweater with love in every stitch. I get it. But I can't possibly wear this many sweaters on any occasion. <laughs> so it just ends up getting shoved into the drawer. And it's like it's overflowing. And so that's why I have boxers over there. And that happens to be one of one pair of boxers that I will wear because they're in pretty decent situation. I do have the boxers that you're talking about, though. Um, 
the threadbare boxers yeah. that the, there's no elastic. It's just a hard <laughs> string. Exactly. Actually, I have a pair of boxer briefs like that. So the only thing holding them up is the thigh portion of that hasn't gotten shot. It's the the waist is just like flopping over, and the thigh portion is holding it up. And it's really awkward to wear, and it's like I can't wear this uh, comfortably in public, even though it'll be covered up. So I I still have those. I don't know why I won't throw them out. I need to go through all my clothing clothing and throw them out. <laughs> I just threw out my my last pair of, of of boxers that did that. It's just like the the elastic around the waist was had just given up. <laughs> so Mickey, it was don't done. give me that look. Don't give me that look. <laughs> Do not give me that look. My girlfriend is listening to this recording and she has to interject on Chime the boxers. In. <laughs> I saw that pair the other day and I was you so saw <laughs> She did see the pair <laughs> the other day. I was like, these don't fix me. They're really great. It's, it's I fantastic. Maybe Yvonne had just left boxers <laughs> and then Julian just thought, oh, I guess I'll use these. <laughs> She thought that you apparently left boxers, <laughs> at, oh. at, and then I just thought, oh, I guess I'll use these. And, <laughs> no, that's not the case. I do have a pair, however, from one of my other friends. I can't I remember the reason. I don't think we would be able to fit in the same boxers. There's like a, a half a foot of height difference in like 30 pounds. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. No, it's not going to... I Look, it's a whole thing. Anyways, that... That's our whole bit on boxers. Thank you very much for listening to the podcast. <laughs> Meundi sponsored the podcast. We just did a segment on your boxers, which apparently you guys should all go invest in, I guess. At least try it What's out. What's the review? What's the review? All right. I say they're well worth trying out. I don't think they're, they're going to satisfy everybody all the time, but I think that they're worth trying out. <laughs> okay. It's a very specific area. I like them. <laughs> But it's not an all-day boxer. You've so, got you've got to come stop. home and then that you get change in to your jammy the boxers ones, that yeah, are a little bit looser. They've yeah, been around the for boxers, a while. <laughs> They've been around for a while. <laughs> you know, they're I, your nighttime I, pals. Yeah, that's great. That's good stuff, man. 